Hello everyone. Currently I'm showing you a video footage. It's pretty much a reflection of where I've started my teaching career. And this was 2007. So I've, I would have taken a, a, a field trip with my high school students, my class, to a ceramic factory. It was a famous one called Wasi Art. I used to do summer jobs there and, and I would have harnessed some skills of how to handle clay even while I was doing that at my tenure at the College of Arts where I've studied. Now this would have refined my skills. So at this point I was actually doing an illustration showing my students how the process of making a, a container, a, a vase or a bowl, in this case a little bowl, soup bowl, from clay. Now, this moment would have inspired a number of my students, well, all of them, and to the point where one of them pursued a career in visual arts. She actually became an art teacher. She's currently an art teacher at a high school. Uh, she would have harnessed her skills as well in pottery and specialize in that field. Now, my motivation came from my early childhood, uh, where my early childhood years, where I used to play with clay in a clay pit where I used to live with my mom and dad. And not many parents, I don't believe they would be happy with their, their child playing in mud or clay for that matter. However, I used to occupy my time playing in that clay pit with my siblings. And I did not even have any clue that I would turn out to be an artist and an art educator. So whenever we see kids um, engage in early years of interaction, developing their psychomotor skills and being creative, uh, we have to encourage them because we don't know where the, their future is going to take them.